right, Slate. Showtime. You sure you don't want to go for a swim? Tyreek told me to tell you to come back with the goal or don't come back at all. Well, I don't think we got to worry about Tariq. No one's ever found anything down there before. What makes you think you're any different? Well, the blue hole is a bottomless pit, but even Cousteau couldn't swim the bottom, and I can. And he didn't have these. So on our guns and C4, you're gonna bury yourself under the sea floor and silk. Now that I won't have to deal with Tariq, will I? I'll have to face him alone and without the gold. Charges here, you guys set the perimeter. I need you going off to the left. Let's go. All right, man, we are set over here.
what I tell you. <sighs> Just wait. Just wait for what? Yeah, I may or may not have a little surprise in store, but it's perfectly safe. Trust me. Why do I need to be reassured that it's safe? Come on, can you just chill out? Relax, enjoy the view. Look where we are. This is amazing. It's gorgeous. We are gonna have so much fun. Mm. Come on, let's get checked in. Today is going to be a beautiful day. You heading back out to the Barrow Reef today? Um, it depends. You available? I need some samples for the lab. I'm actually taking a couple out there in about an hour. Just snorkeling, though. But I'm free for diving this afternoon. 1 p.m. work. 1 p.m.'s perfect. Good. See you then. Babe, let's go. Ready? Yeah. So why didn't we spend a week on the mainland again? You didn't like the Mayan ruins? No, I liked it. It's just seven days of non-stop hiking. It's not my idea of vacation. You helped me plan this trip. OK, fine. You get to choose all the things we do next time. Oh, what makes you so sure there's going to be a next time? We all just stay here and hang out with the locals. Really, bro? You're hilarious, you know that? Are you ready to snorkel or what? Henry, right? Rod, hey, yes. Man. Hi, I'm Jane. Hey, nice to meet you guys. Nice to meet you too. I hope we're not late. Not at all. So you guys ready to go snorkel at the Blue Hole? Yeah, man, yeah. We're both really excited. The Blue Hole? Yes, the Blue Hole. Welcome on board. Thanks. Right. Yes. So who here has gone snorkeling before? Not like this, you haven't. Snorkeling at the Lighthouse Reef is unlike snorkeling anywhere else on Earth. And if you're really daring, you can swim across the Blue Hole. Most people are not. Now, the ride to the reef is about an hour from here. So I suggest you just relax and enjoy the ride. What is the Blue Hole? It's a huge sinkhole, about three football feet across and six down. And you knew about this. You're gonna love it. You're gonna love it. You're gonna love it. Turn on some music, there, brother. It's gonna be a lot of fun. This hole is huge. Is that a shark? Just tiger sharks, then bull sharks. Rod! <laughs> I'm just kidding. Those are nursing sharks, they're totally harmless. Then what's that spear for? Customers who don't pay.
Take these. I saw a body out there floating. One guy, I don't know if he's conscious, unconscious, or what. We gotta get him out of the water. Start up the engine. There he is. Give me a hand with this. Got a pulse is kind of weak. He probably had a concussion, maybe even the bends. We'd probably better get him to a hospital. No, 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 no hospital. Oh, we can take him back to our place. Well, shouldn't a professional come and look at him? I know someone we can call. Oh. What do you make of that? Guys, he's waking up. Where am I? Who are you guys? We found you out there by the reef, barely breathing. We gave you CPR, but weren't sure if you were gonna make it for a second there. You gave me CPR? You woke up just long enough to say no hospitals, so we brought you back here to this hotel. I'm Sarah. This is Henry. He called me from the boat to meet you, and this is their place. They were on the boat with Henry. Thanks, you guys. I'm Jax. Most people just call me Jax. All right, Jax. How's the head? Drink the local fruit wine, you figure it out. I think I'll survive. So you want to tell us what happened out there? Uh, not really, no. What about this? You want to tell us about this? <laughs> now I'm going to ask you one more time. Where is Tariq's money? I don't know. <clears throat> oh, man, you've been working out. I, uh, I actually felt that one. <sighs> hey, hey! Now, I'm going to ask you one more time. Where is Tariq's money? We didn't find anything, all right? We went into the jungle, there was no Mayan gold, no nothing, just death. i tell you what I think. I think that you found exactly what you were looking for and decided to keep it for yourself and kill our men. You better start making sense. Then where is it? It's at the bottom of the blue hole. What the hell are you talking about? I'm talking about Spanish gold. No one has found it. No one knows where it is. I know where it is. All right. But I'm warning you, 
You try anything, Slate, anything at all, and I will put a bullet in your head and bury you in that hole myself. Okay, I get it, I get it. I found it snorkeling. It's amazing what people leave behind, huh? You mean like the Mayans? I dove to the bottom of the blue hole. You went to the bottom? What else did you find? Hey, look, man, you don't have to tell us anything you don't want to, but I'm sure the police will find this out pretty interesting. I don't want to involve you guys in anything too dangerous, but if you really want to know, um, get me a beer and let's go outside. Yes, boss. Any sign of them, boy? No, boss. But the whole area around the blue hole. Shut down and are locked. The coast guard them, they are like one glasses. Them find a boat missing. Rick, mash up the rats. Passengers presumed dead. What the rats they want me to do? I want you to keep looking until you find them. Or their bodies. Yes, boss. Raul, let's go. So you're saying you owe this Tariq guy a lot of money and you're gonna pay him off with the gold? Don't forget Tariq. As far as he knows, I'm already dead. That gold's still out there. I'll tell you what, I'm willing to cut you in if you guys help me find it. Aren't you forgetting something? Someone out there did kill those men. And if it wasn't you, then we should be worried about who or what. What do you mean, or what? I mean, right now we don't know anything. But Dr. Jones here has been setting up charges in Blue Hole, so, so who knows what the hell he's unearthed? What exactly are you saying? I'm saying I'm in. I don't care about the Spanish gold or lost treasure. I just want to know what's out there. I care about the gold. <laughs> yes, me too. Rod. Count me in. Listen, we came out here to dive that hole anyways. And now I see more reasons to go. A lot more. I say we go for the gold. Police will be patrolling the air between here and the reef. Well, then we'll have to go the long way around Half Moon Key, huh? Help me with the rest of this. Any sign of Edric and the others? No, boss. On the slate. I think why not? With some different people. Done of we people. That bastard had double crossed us for the last time. You know what to do. Yes, boss. And the rest of them? No witnesses. Not one to tell the tale. Yes, boss. When they corrupt half moon key, we're on the wait for them. Let's go. seriously going through with this? I mean, I don't want to die on some wild goose chase for some lost treasure. Did you forget the part where some gangsters are trying to kill him? Or, like she said, there could be something out there that's even worse than them. Stop acting like you're in the Goonies. The Goonies? Listen, I think that you need to calm down, change your mind, and come with us. It's gonna be a lot of fun. No, Rod. I want us to stay together. Otherwise, I'm gonna go back to the hotel, and you can have your little adventure on your own. I hear you. I just think it's a little bit too late for that. We're already set, loaded up, ready to go. There could be a lot of gold out there. Look, if you go on that dive, I'm gonna be really upset. I'm gonna go. We'll see you back at the hotel, okay? Just me. Woman doesn't look too happy with you. Yep. Don't worry. She'll be a lot happier when you bring back the gold, huh? That's the plan. Raul, let it come. See them there? Get ready for leak shot.
Now, remember, when they get close, they'll pull up side of them. I say hello, and then goodbye. out there. Check that out. Take me to it. with no sign of survivors. Not even any bodies. What the hell is going on? This is the Coast Guard. Remain where you are. Damn. Great. We got visitors. Prepare to be boarded. You people want to tell me what the hell you're doing out here? You got a name? Who's asking? Cut the bullshit. I want to know who you people are and what you're doing at the Blue Hole. Blue Hole? Don't play dumb with me. That boat of yours had a registered dive out of the hole at nine this morning. And then there's this. You fancy yourself some kind of treasure hunter? Look, you can't keep us here. We haven't done anything wrong. Where do you think you are? You think this is the US? I've got two boats destroyed, covered in blood. Maybe you did find something, and maybe you killed your friend over it. Okay, look, my name's Jackson Slate. I was diving the bullet hole, see what I could salvage. Last thing I remember, there was an earthquake. When I came to, these people rescued me. We decided to come back out here and investigate, and that's when we found this. Look, we've got a real problem here. And I think we know damn well it isn't us. In all my years, Working these parts, I have never seen anything like this. Oh, my God. Let alone twice in one goddamn day. Not even drug runners. This wasn't drug runners. This was bitten off by something big. Something really big. Whatever it is, it's big enough to tear a dive boat to shreds. We need to have an advisory and tell the people to stay out of the water. We need to go to that blue hole. Think about it. This all started after he went down there. Maybe he disturbed something. We need to know what we're dealing with, while we can still do something about it. All right, Slade. Look like you get to go back and hunt for your lost treasure after all. Yeah, what about... Sorry. Property of Belize. At least we know where there's more. Any word from Rafa and Raul? Nothing yet, big man. Here not that by sundown. I'll find Jackson Slate myself and skin him and his friends alive. So Jackson, you left out a few details when you were talking to the police. What do you think really happened down there? Honestly, I think Therese guys blew the charges early and left me for dead. And somebody came back and took care of them. I'm sure you got a different theory. Yeah, all I know is there's something out there destroying boats. And we just happen to be on a boat. These guys got plenty of gunpowder and sonar. Anything comes at them, I'm sure they'll take care of it. Tell me, how did you get involved with those low-life gangsters anyway? And were you really gonna pay them back the gold? Of course. Probably. It's probably not. <laughs> well, I'm with 
Beautiful. Hello, sweetheart. Hey, what's up, guys? No, nothing. We're just down here in Belize for training right now. Just kind of drinking, relaxing, kicking in with the locals. I don't know if you're interested, but uh, my buddy, he's got a boat right down the beach. Want to join us? A boat? Yeah, would you like to see it? Uh, no, I shouldn't. Oh, come on. You can lay out. We'll drink tons of champagne, have some caviar. You guys are full of shit. You'll never know unless you go. You boys don't want to go for a swim? <laughs> I don't get paid enough to do anything this crazy. All right. Well, then just keep a lookout, will ya? Good luck. Thank you. You afraid of the dark? Not the dark. Just what's in it. I told you what's in it. It's Spanish gold. <laughs> yeah, baby. In some people's opinion, Mayan gold. Let me tell you, it's not what's in it that you gotta be afraid of. When you get down to about 200 feet, the pressure's gonna be so bad, it's gonna make your chest feel like it's gonna explode. Get down to 300, nitrogen narcosis kicks in, you're gonna feel dizzy, you're gonna think that you might be seeing some things, but it's nothing compared to when you get down to 400 feet. You know what, Jax? Why don't you save it? If you panic and you come up too fast, you're gonna die. So just breathe normal and don't panic. When you guys feel like you need to back out now, now's the time to tell me. <laughs> you know, Jax, I'm uh, not really one to back out of things, ever. Uh, but I think it'd be a good idea to keep a man on board and, you know, an eye on things, make sure you guys are safe while you're down there diving. So, I think I'm gonna set this one out, huh? Yeah, sure. Hey, I, I still get my cut, though, right? Yeah. All right. You're a good man. Good luck, bud.
I've seen enough. Let's get out of here. Ah! Oh my god! Oh my god! Relax. You alright? <laughs> okay. Yeah. Yeah, I'm good. Down there for a long time, man. I thought we lost you. You nearly did. <sighs> yeah, we ran into my old crew down there. They were torn apart, trampled or something. What else did you guys see down there? <sighs> we saw footprints. Big ones. Well, did you see what left them? No. We found this. What the hell's that? That's what I intend to find out. <sighs> The advisor is still in effect. Stay out of the water. You better go try to find Jane. She's probably worried about me. I'll still give you guys a ride to the mainland once he opens up the harbor. Hey, Jax. Want to come back to the lab with me? I could use an assistant. Uh, sure. Great, great. Now, you still owe me a refund for that ride, man. Hey, I did take you guys out. You know where to find me. Yes, boss. It's me. I'm Hong Slay. He's with the marine biologist. I'll keep an eye on them. I'm not crazy. That's a big ass egg, right? You're not crazy, but it's time we took a look inside. Uh, what are we looking at? No, it couldn't be. This has all the traits of being some kind of dinosaur. An ancestor, maybe? I don't know. You mean like the extinct kind? Well, not entirely. I mean, technically, crocodiles are dinosaurs. Birds, too. So you're saying there's more of these out there? It would seem so. And how big do you think it might be? I mean, based on the size of the footprints and the fact that it tore apart two dipoles like it was nothing, I'd say at least 40 to 50 feet tall, but to learn more, we're gonna have to crack her open. Okay, you need some help with that? Uh, yeah, just don't break anything. Hey, you got any beer? Right in the fridge over there. <sighs> Here you go. Thanks. It's your beer. I mean, from before. We would have died down there had it not been for you. You wouldn't have been out there unless it was for me. <sighs> well, that's true. Oh, now, I want you to make yourself useful. Put this on. You really think all this is necessary? And gloves. You've seen Alien, right? Never be too careful. Okay, what do you want me to do? Okay, great. No, I want you to hold it just like this, nice and straight. Very, very, very gentle. Keep it nice and steady. I'm just going to chip the top. Oh, God. It's awful. What is that? It's hydrogen sulfide and methane. A bit pungent, but nothing you can't handle. Do you see it? Jax, look at the corner, by the 
Though. Didn't get much better though, could it? It's not that bad, is it? What are you doing? What, babe? I thought you came here to party. I did. I um, I just need another mimosa. All right, babe. I'll be right back. Thanks. Party's over. Party's got to end sometime, doesn't it? long and 100,000 pounds. Four times more powerful than the Tyrannosaurus Rex. But this one had flippers. That's not our guy. Yeah, our guy didn't have flippers. Oh, how to move! Take it easy! Take it easy! Take it easy. Take it easy. Blow these beats head off. Slow down! I said don't move. I knew you had the brain for science, Slate. Where is my gold? It's not what you think, Derek. What I think, what I think is you got greedy, guys, man. You saw all that gold, and you thought you could just cut me off and steal. Again! Look, it, it's, it's not like that, okay? A lot of weird stuff's been going on. A lot of people have been dying lately. You're right about that. Tell me where the gold is, and I might. Let your woman live for a while. <laughs> it's in the fridge. Check it. Careful. It might be a trick. Come <laughs> on. 
All right, Jane. Jane. I'm sorry about your girlfriend. We should be safe enough here at the docks, but we're dealing with something pretty lethal out there. I saw that thing's arms and head sticking out of the water. It's a goddamn monster. So what do we do now? I don't know. Those little ones are like gremlins from hell, though. And they won't stay little for long. You're right. We should have destroyed those eggs while we had the chance. Well, how many of those eggs were down there? Two dozen. If just one of those things can do that to a sailboat, can you imagine what two dozen are gonna do? Yeah, or how long before they become 200 to 200,000? We gotta do something right here, right now. Or else we're gonna be dealing with- A new apex predator, the top of the food chain, and the end of our time as a species. We gotta destroy those eggs. All right, guys, we're headed back out to the hole. Let's go. Hey, guys, get ready. Let's go. How come we've never seen this thing before? Maybe we have. Nautical tales of sea monsters are as old as humanity itself. Who knows what's out there? I mean, for all we know, Poseidon Rex could have been hibernating for the past 400 years, or even the last 400,000. Maybe nobody ever saw it and lived, like the crew of the Cortez. Wait, what'd you call it? Poseidon Rex, king of the ocean. Just like the T-Rex was king of the land, T-Rex ruled the sea, only bigger and stronger. So you get to name it? Perk of the job. King of the sea, huh? We'll see about that. Make no mistake, P-Rex may have been one of the most fearsome creatures to ever walk the Earth. Or swim the Earth, anyway. OK, so how do we kill this thing? Well, even P-Rex is just an animal. It bleeds like anything else. So we get guns, right? Probably just a reef. Means we're getting close. There's something coming up beneath us, something really, really big. Look alive on those guns. It's coming in fast. It's almost here. Where is it now? It's underneath us! I think we got it. I think we just pissed it off. There's no way it survived all that. I've got something. I think it's back. Oh my god. Henry!
Let's get back to the dock. Let's get off the water, huh? This place looks like a ghost town. Yeah, that tends to happen. People see a prehistoric monster come out of the water. They got to get the hell off the island. So you're gonna call in the cavalry, right? We'll bring enough firepower to send it back to the Ice Age. Cretaceous period, actually. It... I... Uh, uh, never mind, it doesn't matter. Just don't forget those eggs are still out there. We'll nuke the goddamn hole if we have to. What about us? I suggest you people hide. Just be careful. I think he knows better than to come after us again. Okay, guys, let's go. You guys, uh, this is the one place we're safe. I mean, T Rex rule the water, not the land. You sure about that? Uh, on second thought, maybe we better run. Definitely run! Come on, come on, come on, let's go! Move, move, move! Everybody run! Get out! Someone must have signaled for help. It should be coming, right? I don't know. I gotta think we're on our own. We need to get out of here before that thing comes back. And go where? At Henry's boat. It's just on the dock. It's 40 miles of the mainland. You want to take that chance? Because there's an old military base on the other side of the island past the town. We can hide there. All right. I'll try and distract it. And, uh, you guys make your way to the car, OK? Good luck. Keys. What? Look for keys. Take the body. Keys. 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 Got him. Got him. Got him. Let's go. Let's go. <gasps> no, we're not leaving without Jax. You... No, he'll be back any minute. Jax. 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 Let's go. Hey. Tariq. You're uh alive. No thanks to you, Slade. Where is my gold? We're going, uh, we're going to get it right now. Yeah. Now I get my gold and my revenge. But before I do, I want to kill you. Get in, let's go, let's go. Nice drive for marine biologists. We just follow this road for a couple more miles. Yeah, I just want to make one more stop. Where? I guess we'll find out. That just tried to kill us? Yep. So why would you take us here? Oh, shit. 
shit. That's why. Man, now that's more like it. I don't think we've seen the lapse of that thing. I don't know about you, but I'm not much for hiding. I say we either kill that thing or die trying. Oh, we're gonna kill it. Farther you think that base is? Not more than a mile or so. All right, let's keep moving. Let's go. I don't know. It doesn't matter. Hopefully we can get a signal out from inside and call for help. At the very least, a place to hide. It's on grid. Oh, this place gives me the creeps. Well, safer in here than out there, right? I guess. So what are we looking for? Power. Jackpot. You think you'll get it up and running? We'll see. I'll be back. I'm gonna go check things out. Where's your off to? Found the armory. Did you find anything? Oh, yeah. yeah. Grenades, rocket launchers. You name it. You did it. 
sure how long it'll last. Let's see if we can find a radio. Great. Okay. This thing looks ancient. It is. This is Jackson Slade on the Ambergris Key. We are alone and we're in trouble. Anyone out there, please respond over. Uh, anyone out there, read me over. Anyone out there, over? This is Jack Slade of the Ambergris K. We are alone and in trouble. Anyone out there, copy this, get back over. I gotta assume we're still alone. Found a little two-seater airplane in the hangar next door. No help comes in the morning, I'll fly that thing out of here. What if it comes back before then? Well, then we'll give it hell. Get some rest. I'll keep watch. On private. Sir, something strange. I received a transmission on an old military band, one that hasn't been used in over 30 years. That is strange. Actually, that's not even the strange part. Where did it originate from? Ambergus Key, the old military base over there. That outpost has been abandoned for decades. What did it say? Actually, sir, you won't believe this. business of treasure hunting. Hmm. I think getting in is easy. It's the getting out part that's hard. <laughs> I've noticed. <laughs> and how did you end up mixed up with a guy like Tariq anyway? Tariq. Uh, I don't think you can say what I do is exactly legal, so <laughs> sometimes you need somebody that knows the ins and outs of a country, right? Mm. And I take it. You probably won't be turning any of that gold into any local government or a museum. Would you? Mm. So what about you? If you're not motivated by money, I mean, you're obviously not motivated by danger. Hey, there's plenty of danger in what I do. <laughs> a jellyfish sting, you know. A jellyfish, huh? Mm-hmm. Well, the immortal jellyfish, to be exact. They live in the Blue Hall. I've been studying them for the past three years. Do you have any idea what you've done, by the way? By setting up those explosives, you've done irreparable damage to their habitat. Okay, well, slow down, okay? I think finding the shit that's been missing for over 400 years is a little more important than some jellyfish. Uh, these jellyfish live forever. Forever? As an immortal. 
they never die. They may hold the key to unlocking the secret of human immortality. Ugh. I was just scratching the surface of all the secrets the Blue Hole may have been hiding. Wait a second, you don't think that thing that uh, Poseidon Rex is I immortal as well, do you? I don't really know at this point. so old. I figured they had the stuff lying around and I was right. What is it? A telegraph. Morse code? Who are you trying to reach? There. The jungle? No. It's a U.S. Army base. How do you know it's there? Trust me. It's there. So now what? Now we wait. Okay, well, what'd you tell them? I told them a 50-foot sea monster was attacking the island, killing everybody, and that they needed to do something about it. Yeah, I'm sure they're gonna take that seriously, huh? Well, it was worth a shot. Wait a minute. What's that sound? Shh. You're not gonna like it. They got your message last night. They have satellite imaging of the creature and are tracking it now. We have to be off the island in 20 minutes. Why? What happens in 20 minutes? It's gonna be an all-out aerial assault. They're gonna level the whole thing. What are you talking about? There's still people here. What are we gonna do? The airplane. But only if it's two people. Yeah, well, only one of us is going up. You guys get down to the pier. I'll try and distract it. on the creature? Yes, sir. It's still rampaging the entire island. Bring it up on the monitors, please. Zoom. Closer. Oh my God. Sir, you won't believe this. I just received a message from the civilians at the base, the ones from last night. Morse code. They're still alive. I hope you told them they got less than 20 minutes to get out of that area before I glass the whole damn thing. Sir, we have to give them time to escape. I can't let that thing get off the island. Let's hope your friends can. Proceed.
Come on, you bastard, follow me. Later, you are weapons free if you can make visual contact with the target. to leave this airspace at once. Now listen here. I'm the one that called the SOS. Goddamn monsters been attacking the island. Come here, take the wheel! Get it, Rod! Get it! Be careful, Rod! Oh. You are ordered to immediately leave the area before aerial bombardment commences. There's still people on the island. The creature's not on land anymore. It's in the water. Lieutenant, have him paint the target. We're tracking your position. If you continue to paint the target, we can get a lock. Do you understand, Mr. Slate? I do. Paint the target, lock onto his transponder signal. Affirmative. Sir. T minus thirty seconds. Creature is down. Clean up team in there immediately. Good job. Good job. What about Slate? <laughs> Sir, it's back. No. No, it's impossible. Look. Hey there. You're alive. Jax. How'd you like a vacation? How about a different island? Sounds good to me. Aren't we forgetting something? The gold? No. 
I'm in the eggs. <laughs> 